if you watched part one of the series, then you know that your submission of the business license annual actual for 2023 is a requirement for filing the business license annual estimate and renewal application for 2024. Here's a scenario of BLAA and BLAE. John Doe's revenue for 2023 is $110,000 and $90,000 in 2022. When renewing his license in 2023, he would have stated $90,000 as his turnover, as this was the amount that his business made in 2022. When he logs into OTAS to renew his license in 2024, he must first file his business license annual actual for 2023, indicating an actual turnover of $110,000. The system will then apply his tax rate, which is 0.5%, and indicate that he has a balance of $550 for 2023, which should be paid by April 2nd, 2024. After filing his business license annual actual for 2023, he will submit his business license annual estimated for 2024. John Doe's business license annual estimated for 2024 would be $110,000, the same as his actual turnover for 2023. Taxes for the 2023 license are determined based on the actual revenue of that year. Any difference between the estimate and the actual revenue may result in owing taxes or being eligible for a credit. Accountants reports and supporting spreadsheets are required for accounts that are $250,000 and above. In part three, we'll give you a breakdown of the tax rates and how they are calculated. To access more videos like this, visit our website, YouTube channel, or social media pages.